Hello Cancerians and welcome to your extended for this full moon. I just completed your part one reading. So I'm just going to get right into the clarification. Use the modern witch deck, <clears throat> which a lot of readers use by the way. So I think I didn't realize at the time that it was such a popular deck when I, uh, when I got it. I think mine is like the mini size because I've seen a lot of other readers have a larger. I mean, like this fits in the palm of my hand. So um, just like a regular plain deck of cards um, size. So anyway, if I, if I ever get a link up, I'll put, <laughs> put the link up and, uh, you know, Let's see what we have, um, please, for the Cancerians, for this Nine of Wands, Five of Wands, and the Star. What? Tell us more, please, about the Five of Wands here. The Chariot, the Sun, and the Five of Pentacles. Well, I feel like some of you like had really gone through a breakup um, and kind of like over creative differences. Um, so maybe for some of you, this is like a business partnership. Um, and, you know, and for some of you, this might just be kind of like, <laughs> I hate to say it, but you know, okay, so you're, you're the one shining here. You're the sun and somebody else is feeling left out. Well, you know, don't like necessarily put that on yourself. Like that might have to do with their insecurity more than you. So especially if you're going through a breakup and that is a situation, just remember that, you know, the p other people's motivations may really have nothing to do with you as a person. Like you're doing you and winning at your life. Like that's what you're supposed to be doing is what I'm hearing from spirit. So, um, just remember that as you, um, go through, you know, the challenges. Um, <clears throat> so, you know, start out here with the wounded here, the nine of wands, we have the star card, uh, you know, possibly dealing with an Aquarius, but I feel like this is your energy cancerians, especially with her, foot dipped in the water. I mean, the crab by the sea, you know, like, I don't know, but she's obviously a, be a soft shell crab for her. <laughs> the, ooh, the queen of cups. So Scorpio, Cancer, Pisces, um, 10 of cups and the knight of swords. So somebody definitely sees you as their, um, happy ending. Like, they want to make this happen and they're coming rather quickly to tell you. Um, and it is, it is a, a night energy. So just maybe be a little, um, cautious of, of their excitement, but definitely be open to the communication. Um, cause they see you in this queen of cups energy here. Um, so whatever, you know, you've kind of direction you've taken, it seems to have been working in your favor. Uh, what more about this? Uh, Eight of Swords, please. The Knight, well, I mean, we already kind of qualified the Ace it's with the Nine of Swords and the Six of Cups. Because we said, um, yeah, for a lot of you, you're just going to be, or your person is letting go of things that just don't pertain to you anymore. I mean, that's, I don't know how else to say that. Um, with the six of cups. So tell us more about this reconciliation, please spirit. Thank you. <clears throat> Sometimes it's like, have to figure out what is the right question to ask. <laughs> so that's how I'm, I'm a more of an intuitive reader. I don't just pull cards just to pull cards, but, um, Nine of Wands, Four of Wands, and Page of Wands. 
So again, you have the wounded warrior here. So I feel so I feel like this whoever and wow, the four of wands. So that's totally about reconciliation and partnership. And, you know, new beginnings here with the page. Um, willing to willing to start again. Um, yeah. Cancer, I feel like for some of you that this is, and, and I feel like for some of you, so this, this other nine of wands, I feel like this is your, your match. Like you're even standing in the same position. And I mean, this isn't specific to male and female necessarily you could have, but it could just be more, you know, like the masculine and feminine energies that, you know, are, are always attracting each other. Um, and going back with our nourishment theme, I mean, that's being in a healthy balance relationship, that yin and yang. So, you know, you don't want so, you know, if you just are so masculine all the time, you're just going to get like burnout. out. The same if you're like so feminine all the time, if you're just like, you know, in way in your emotions all the time, like, you know, are you, you know, you can't just like cry all day long, right? <laughs> I mean, I suppose you can and like I kind of have, but you know what I mean? <laughs> Like it, that's not, you know, it's exhausting. So, um, you know, be open to this new beginning, this reconciliation for a lot of you Cancerians here. Uh, tell us more about the six of swords. What's, who's leaving what? I mean, I feel like this is your person that's coming towards you and leaving. Yeah. Oh yeah. Leaving. Mm-hmm behind Woo. okay so the ace of wands the devil card and the ten of pentacles yeah this person sees you as their destiny and i feel like they are completely leaving behind this kind of you know they have the sword here they can cut these ties and I feel like that's what they're doing. And they're coming towards you to say, hey, you know, and here, I mean, you already have the Ten of Cups over here. Now you have the Ten of Pentacles too. Like, okay. I mean, that's a pretty good deal, right, Cancer? <laughs> I know it's in Cancer, it's always like, you know, it's like inner feelings and be like, oh, but you know, it's everything that, per like we want everything to be perfect and, you know, every emotion to be felt and, you know, but I mean, this person's coming towards you with the cup of love here, this Knight of Cups. Um, so, so, so we can take a look at this Knight of Cups for the Cancerians, please. Because they see you as the magician adding to the wands. I mean, so, you know, one becomes two. Wow, the Empress and then the Two of Cups. Oh my gosh. I am so excited for you guys. Is the two of cups, you know, the four of wands, ten of pentacles, ten of cups. I, I don't know what else to say. Um, they're seeing you as the empress, um, you know, or it could be an emperor as well. And, you know, we are moving into Taurus season. So for a lot of people, that means like working on those kind of like stable partnerships. And it looks like, you know, you've, ch you know, chosen wisely here right recognized what's going on within yourself with the star card um you know are in the process of loosening you know these these ties here and well yourself included right you know whatever those you know and maybe for you it wasn't a romantic thing or anything i feel like for this person maybe that has has something to do with it um but it doesn't really matter what they're I mean, it does matter what they're leaving. Like you want to kind of know like people's reasons for things, but they're doing it in a positive manner to develop growth into a healthy relationship. Then, I mean, that's right. So yeah. And, and I mean, you're the empress, so you're going to know, you're going to know if this person's full of do or not. I mean, <laughs> you know, like you've been there and done that you've gone through it, you know, so they, you know, they can't come to you with a, with a shoddy, with a shoddy offer, I guess. 
<laughs> like leave that to this, you know? Ugh. Oh my God, there's like a ring there. Like, <laughs> I mean, for some people that's like what marriage is, but uh, anyway, that's for another uh, philosophical discussion that I am not going to get into today. <laughs> <laughs> Let's pull a few on the on the magician. Oh, I just saw the world card at the at the end here. So uh yeah, temperance, the eight of pentacles, and, and judgment. Yeah, just keep on just yeah, have have keep the faith, you know, the temperance card. Keep on working on your manifestations and you know your your judgment your time is going to come when you're going to be seen for all this all this awesomeness and you're going to get what you've been um desiring here so oh my goodness anyway uh thanks for tuning in with the notification bell if you'd like to receive future messages from this channel bye